Hello again. So we went over three of our vocab words yesterday and we are going to go over the next three now. So you should have printed all of them out. You should have maybe at least made flashcards for the first three. Maybe you've already made it for all six. So let's go over our words. Our first, well actually our fourth word is cross. Look at this picture. Now there's two meanings for cross. Right away, when we think of cross, we probably think crossing the street, going to the other side, right? But cross can also mean you're very annoyed or angry. So cross is something we call a multiple meaning word. It has more than one meaning. Okay, have you ever been cross with somebody? Have you ever been annoyed or angry with anyone? I'm sure we all can say we have, especially if we have a little brother or sister, right? And then we have all crossed the street or crossed and gone from one side to the other. So that is what cross means. It has two meanings. The next word is realize. Realize means to become aware of something or understand something maybe that you did not understand before, okay? So I'm sure you can all think of a time where you've realized you've become aware of something you didn't know. Hmm, I didn't realize that you had a twin sister, Miss Nelson. And we're gonna dig into Miss Nelson. We're gonna go way back in our time machines today and talk about Miss Nelson again. Yes, one of my favorites. And then the last word for this week is savory. Savory means pleasant to smell or taste. And a lot of you guys in your author's chair wrote some very savory, um, sentences with lots of sensory details. All right, so here we go. Read it with me. The blank smell of chocolate chip cookies filled the room. Which one do you think? Cross, realize, or savory? Hmm. Well, when I see smell, my brain remembers that savory means a pleasant smell or taste. And then I, my brain noticed even more, one of my favorite foods, chocolate chip cookie. Is a chocolate chip cookie a pleasant or savory smell? Yes, absolutely. And I, my marker died. So those are the context clues for this sentence. Read it with me with the correct word. The savory smell of chocolate chip cookies filled the room. Mm, I can smell them and taste them already. All right, our next one. Are we ready? Olivia felt blank when Owen broke her new toy. It's happened before. The other day, popped the Barbie's head right off. And she was very, what? Realize or cross? She was very angry and annoyed with him. She was cross. So what was the context clue? Well, uh, when Mr. Owen broke her what? Toy. Right away you should know if someone breaks your toy, you're gonna be pretty irritated. And then we have one word left. And I'm wondering if you, this sentence pertains to you. So let's see if this makes sense with our word realize. But then I want to know if you knew this. Did you realize Monday was a holiday? Did you know that you had school off? Mainly because teachers had to do report cards. That wasn't the holiday though. See if you can find out what holiday was on Monday. I'm wondering if you will realize, if you will know, 
what holiday was on Monday. And if you didn't realize, get a calendar out and see if you can find out what holiday is on, was on Monday. All right, so those are your six vocabulary words. Remember, try to use them. The more you use them, the better you're gonna get at them. Make sure you make your flashcards, you study for your quiz on Friday. And remember, we lost today because we didn't have school on Monday. So make sure you're really practicing and studying those words. All right, I'll talk to you later, bye.